Um, okay, so we have this 10 by 7 on here, and I'm kind of worried it's not going to be enough. It has really has high pitch speed um, with this motor and four cell. It should be around 84 miles an hour, which should give us the airspeed we need to keep this thing flying without being on full throttle. But uh, it's only about 2,600 grams of thrust, which is about what the plane weighs. So I have a one to one power ratio. So technically, it should work. But we're going to find out. Hold on. It flumped. I can tell my dude that it doesn't have a lot of power. Might have to go back to the uh, prop that was on there, the carbon fiber ones. Well, that one actually overheated the motor. Oh. Uh, even though it was a 12 by 4. Okay, let's try it again. It's taking off like a real plane there. It's having like a, oh no. Oh, whoops, fell on the ground there. Turn, turn, turn. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, jeez. Still kind of flying wonky. Every time I try to, uh, every time I try to have a smooth landing, it's just, it's... Ah, yeah. Broke the... Yeah, it's so heavy. It's so nose heavy. Um, Probably just bend that back. Yeah, I got, I'm gonna have to fix it. Oh, it's go. so, it just feels so nose heavy. Um, yeah, that sucks. Broke the landing gear again. I just I try to come in um, decently, and it's like it barely has enough thrust to get off the ground. So, and it's a bummer. Um, this is de this prop's definitely not going to work, even though it has high pitch speed. Um, it's just it's not it's not going to work. The 11 inch is not going to work. Um, I haven't tried a 13 by four. I feel like um, this was a 2,600 grams of thrust, um, but it's just barely enough. You can see it just barely got off the ground and I had to be at full throttle. So it's just not enough. The 11 inch prop actually did okay. But again, I had to have it closer to full throttle. Even though it was 3,300 grams of thrust, it, it had a 60 mile an hour pitch speed uh, with this motor and battery, but it still quite wasn't enough, which is weird because I ran a 12 by four and that had similar pitch speed um, and similar thrust, but I was able to run that at half throttle and it flew no problem at all. Um, but when we switched to a carbon fiber, a lighter prop, we ended up overheating the ESC. So I don't know, it's definitely, it's definitely, I don't know gotta figure it out um maybe maybe we'll try running um i have some smaller uh 2200 milliamp four cells coming which weigh considerably less than the 3300 um so i'm gonna give that a try and see if the lighter battery will help um this thing does seem to fly pretty nose heavy i have to be back on the uh, a bee on your head um but I didn't have to do that with the 12 by four. Like it seemed to fly perfectly. It was like no effort at all. Um, so I guess it's back to the drawing board. Uh, I might have to run a lighter battery and then also go back to at least a 12 inch prop. So we have enough thrust and then enough um, pitch speed, but we're just gonna keep on experimenting until we get this thing right. Um, also, I may switch out the motor too. This motor um, is a good one and it's a big motor. It's got a lot of speed, but it just can't handle high pitch um, props, at least none that are that big. Um, 
we ran a four, uh, 14 by 6 on here before, and it did, or no, I don't know if it was on this motor or the other one, but the it was just too much for thunder. it. Too much stress, uh, and it couldn't do it. So we might end up upgrading the motor, getting a bigger motor that can handle a larger, higher pitched prop, and that might be the winning combination. We're just going to keep on experimenting until we get it.